Ron, uh, you came away with a bit of silverware. Uh, overall, a, a very uh, worthwhile exercise for you guys. Yeah, I, we made a few mistakes, uh, especially day one, early on today. Uh, and thankfully, you know, those are mistakes we would have made in at our own tournament in Hong Kong uh, had we not been here to go through that process. Um, to come away with the plate, I think it was, the plate, <laughs> whatever it was, but we were happy to win and uh, the boys have had a great time here. But, but also, as you say, rather than make those mistakes now, you've got two weeks to sort it out before Hong Kong. Yeah, of course. Um, we, we won the Asian Championships in uh, November uh, after a series there and it's been a while playing club rugby, 15 aside rugby back in Hong Kong. So it's a good tournament, a tough tournament for us to switch back on. Overall, for most of the boys, the first time experience to Africa. For, yeah, first time. For me, first time in Zimbabwe, I've absolutely loved it. I think we're going to uh, see some animals tomorrow. So it should be really good fun. Excellent. Thank you very much thank for you your man. time. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Dai, uh, a worthwhile exercise for you guys. You came away with some silverware, which is always a confidence booster. But uh, overall, uh, a long trip to make, but, but very valuable lessons learned. Our trip to Zimbabwe has been fantastic for our preparation. Uh, there's a quality tournament uh, developing here with South Africa Academy here, Zimbabwe, Kenya, um, but to name three, four quality teams, Georgia. Um, so it's been a real, really uh, great exercise for us. Came unstuck against Zimbabwe, bad loss, but it's a wake-up call for our tournament in two weeks' time. I was about to say you'd rather make those mistakes now. You know exactly now where you stand and how much work you still need to put in in the next two weeks. We've never been able to attend a tournament like this in Zimbabwe with the quality teams um, two or three weeks out from the Hong Kong tournament. And we've come very much unstuck in our own tournament in, in front of 45,000. So hopefully we've, we've dusted off the cobwebs and we'll be ready for Hong Kong in two weeks' time. And hopefully we're in the top 16 to perform at the top end of the game with the top sides on the, on the circuit. Hope to see you back soon.